something is going on in my neighborhood and I don't know what it is, but there's a fire truck and an ambulance. dog sitting for our flower girl's parents because they're in Disney World right now. Oh, I know what So happened. jealous. And Danny's trying to cook chicken fingers for us um, and the things didn't heat up. This is a different than yours. Well, I guess it's the same, but at your house, it's already it's always set to a temperature. This was set to zero. Oh. So I had it in well, there for like 15 minutes. We waited 15 minutes so our chicken would be done and it wasn't it was on set, a temperature. So. It wasn't on a temperature. So now I have to wait another 15 minutes. Yeah, now there's freezing Actually, chicken. Actually, maybe less because it's thawed a little bit. I plugged it I'm in. I'm hungry. This, this is take two of our chicken fingers. Danny, it's freezing in there still. Oh my god, maybe it doesn't work. I guess this thing doesn't work because we've been waiting for these chickens. Function. It's cold, they're freezing. Is this why? Because the function was off? I don't know. Let's just use the regular I'm oven. I'm just going to try this one more time. Oh. Warm. That's all I need. Now they're thawed, so it will be a little quicker. Ten minutes. Wait. All right, I'm gonna check this in. I'm gonna see if it warms. Like, is it warm? I think I think I feel. Yeah, warm it is. It is. Right. Can you give me one more kiss? All right. No, Hershey kiss. <laughs> My hand. Danny is abusive towards me. Throws Hershey kisses at me. So I think that I am going to get a pedicure with my friend who is Danny's friend. She graduated with him. Her and her boyfriend graduated with Danny and that's how I know them. I think we're going to go out to dinner with them too. They're like our couple buddies who are like this with them. We always double with them. How cute. Devoured. <clears throat> All by Danny. Just kidding. What should we do for dinner tonight? <laughs> um, I want to eat some food. Kylie Laura Jeffrey said that my accent threw her off and she didn't know um what like she about Turks and Caicos she said she had to google it because my accent threw her off oh yeah. I wonder where she's from people seem to be saying that you have the accent really and not, and not me I, well I saw one comment that said that they noticed your accent but they didn't notice mine I guess it depends on where those, the people are from whoever maybe commented. it's just because my family talks more South Jersey than you yeah I talk normal <sighs> I talk like I'm from North Jersey, but I have some South Jersey. Oh, she's from Australia, so we definitely do have a different accent. Yeah, yeah. Well, shout out to you, Kylie. So I, I'm, I wonder if that's the person that said um, I have a horrible Australian accent. Like when I was, <laughs> Probably. Somebody said that in the comments, but I forget who it was. That's funny. I told Danny, we are um, in Guterres and Caicos. They speak, they're British. So I told him that I'm going to, like, use my British accent there and he was like, don't do that because I'll probably offend someone. Yeah. <laughs> I'll practice. Any British people, tell me how I do. Hello. My name's Kelsey. <laughs> that wasn't Brit. That was like Irish, I think. I don't know what that Hello. was. Hello. <laughs> that was like a mixture of Australian, British, and Irish. I don't, I don't know. It was like a bunch of different stuff. Top of the morning to you. For anyone who's wondering, this is what it is like for me to look at Danny because of our size difference. I well, I'm also wearing shoes, but... I have to look... Well, either way, I have to look up because... He's taller than me. And bigger than me. <laughs> but... He's... Danny's about 6'1", and I'm about 5'6".
change of plans, I'm actually getting a gel manicure because I already painted my toenails and it's the winter and I don't feel like paying to get my toes done when no one's going to see them unless if I'm walking around the house anyway. So I'm going to get a gel manicure because everyone can see it and it lasts for like two weeks and Danny's laughing at me. He's <laughs> And I think that would be better. And my friend, she's so much like me because she texted me. She's like, I'm going to get an iced coffee because they're 99 cents at Dunkin'. Do you want one? So that just shows that we're meant to be friends. Oh yeah, meant to be forever together. Kelsey's getting her nails done right now. And I am sitting in a parking lot trying to think of what me and her should do for dinner. Now this is a very serious situation and I'm not going to think lightly about it at all. What we want to do is go to the people's house I'm dog watching for and they said we're allowed to hang out there and use the TV and computer and whatever we want to do. So we're probably just going to have dinner there and watch a movie in their basement. But we don't know what we want to eat, and I am very hungry, and so is she, and I just don't know. This is very serious. I want to get something healthy, but, like, there's not that many choices that are, like, very healthy. I want to get something, like, with meat and vegetables. Like, ever since, ever since Christmas, it's been, like, I've been craving unhealthy things, like Burger King, well, not Burger King, really, more like McDonald's or Wendy's. Pizza, cheese steaks, all that stuff. And I kind of went crazy last night at game night eating. I had like five slices of pizza, five slices of pizza and a cheese steak and a half and like sweet raspberry iced tea. And I don't usually eat like that and it made me feel like crap and it tasted delicious, but. I'm craving something like that again, and I'm not going to eat something like that because I want to eat healthy. So, I don't know what I should do. We're thinking maybe Chinese, which is probably not the healthiest thing, but, I mean, you could do worse. At least you get some vegetables with that. They, they do put a lot of vegetables. But, so we're probably going to do Chinese or... I don't know. Danny's at the Red Box picking out a movie. We actually already know what movie we are getting because we checked online first and like watched the previews for it. So he's out there getting it because it's too cold for me. Danny and I are dog sitting, so we are spending some time in the house with the dogs. And we decided that we aren't going to go out to dinner. We're going to, well, we ordered Chinese food and we're going to watch a movie. Yep, that's what we ended up doing. And I, I decided that we're getting Chinese. And we have to go in the basement, but I'm waiting for Danny because he has to go down there first. I don't want to walk down there by myself. Um, one of the dogs jumped on me already. And they're, the one is, like, bigger than the other, but the one is, like, really big. And I'm not used to that. These animals are crazy. <laughs> so I, like, had to, like, defend myself against this. I want white rice. We are going down in the basement, and Danny has to go first. Is there a killer down here? Whoa! Stop! Their basement is set up like a movie. Where's the light? Um, I don't know. We don't need the light. We're going to watch a movie. Well, I want to show what it looks like down uh, here. Um, hold on. I think it's in the oh. other room. Yeah. They set their basement up like a movie theater, so... They have like all these collectibles and stuff, and then they have like a microwave with things for popcorn and all these things, and then they have popcorn and popcorn holders and like snacks. They have candies down here, and they have like a huge we screen. Can bring the DVD in. It's so cute. It appears that someone took a bite out of my pizza roll. That was you. <laughs> I got General's chicken with pork fried rice. Uh, they have P90X. <laughs> and Danny just got plain general's chicken, no rice. I just wanted to read to everyone what my fortune said in my fortune cookie, and it says, ideas that you believe to be absurd ultimately lead to a success. 
and I think that's what I think that's extremely relevant to mine and Danny's life right now because <laughs> there's a lot of things that we Can I have mine? some yeah hold on there's a lot of things that some people think are absurd and there are things that we believe are going to be successful and we believe in and hopefully they will be successful like our fortune set oh you're a big baby sit <laughs> sit good girl see now i'll pet you her head is like bigger than mine <laughs> no whoa no 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 come here no danny no no <laughs> whoa, whoa, get out of here. <laughs> no. Okay, so we're going to call it a night, and we wanted to give a shout out to Paula in England, and we wanted her to know that we're praying for her, and we're going to tell other people that we know to pray for her, and we hope that she feels comfortable and she has a quick and speedy recovery. Good night. Good night. <laughs>